Good to you. Welcome back to another video. And today is Daily Vlog uh, number three. This isn't really a vlog, but I just wanted to do um, a kind of shortcut tutorial. Uh, so yeah, I don't. I've never done one of these before, but I decided. Yeah, let's go for it. Um, and I, I, I will be doing kind of a lot of these. Um, and it's not. It's not just going to be throughout December. I probably will do them later on. Using this software, I have learned a thing or two. I've been using it for about a year now. So, yeah, the first thing you want to do is go up to Open File. And then, I don't want you seeing all my stuff, so. I do have a video here that I can edit. Okay, so, personally, I have all my stuff in uh, USB sticks, so. I have to get them and that's where all my stuff so for me I need to pick my USB stick and then you get that so you get you will get your video out so like right here this is a video that will be coming out soon so what you want to do is you want to go down to here display a menu of additional actions. Now if you don't have this little section down here, that means that you need to go up to the top and you need to click Timeline. If you don't have this uh, Filters option, you need to go up here and click Filters. If you don't have Properties, you need to click Properties. If you don't have Export, then you need to click Export. So, you're going to click add a video track and I usually add three uh, or four usually add four uh, just because that's how much I need so I'm gonna just add that now I'm not gonna go for the full video I'm just gonna show you how to add the kind of face cam uh, like kind of face cam and kind of position the videos so that's what I'm gonna show you so you add that down here or just wherever you want, I'm just going to put it here for this video. My laptop's acting slow because I'm recording. So it will take you to the end of the video, you just want to scroll back to the start. You want to put this bit just anywhere, it doesn't really matter where. So I have a few different ones here. Yeah, you can see I was having some problems. So yeah, it was cutting it. Don't worry about it, like my videos, so yeah, I look kind of weird. Okay, it's finally in. That took some time. So, what you want to do is this will be selected. You want to go into your filter tab. You want to click this little plus sign. It will say add a filter. So, it, you have some favourites already selected. You have the video and audio. So, you want to click on video. It's all in alphabetical order by the way, so then you want to scroll right down. Keep scrolling down until you get to S. Now when you get here, it will say size and position. Now before I want to get here, I just want to say this, these little stars here, that is how you favourite something. So if I unclick that, I'll put it in my favourites. It shows you a little tab up here. So when I click on that, okay so after that it will come up with this kind of thing over your video. So, I'll come up with this little dot in the middle. This is how you move it, drag it. These corners up here, that is how you kind of position it and size it. So, you already this all what you do. You can just drag that down anywhere. You can move it wherever you want. As you know, I usually just have my face cut up here. So you can resize it, drag it, do whatever you want with it. It is your video. And then if you go back to the start you will see that it's there. So that is how you basically add a face cam. So yeah, if you let me know down in the comments below if you need any help with anything else uh, anything else and I will do a tutorial on that um, so 
yeah, if you did enjoy this video, make sure you smash thumbs up, that would be greatly appreciated. Also, add a subscribe button for more Katrina videos and live streams. Link to the control members down in the description below, as well as my second channel and our last video. So, yeah, thank you all for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out. 2nd of December, yeah, that's still the vlog. So, I just update telling you what's going on.